new hope for coral reefs. Researchers have come up with a new tool that will help the monitoring of reef health. So scientists at the University of California, Santa Barbara, the National Center for Ecological Analysis and Synthesis, and other bodies suggest that a five-phase system can help determine more effective means of managing reef recovery. The study that has taken place reveals that communities around the world are potentially missing opportunities to prevent death or bleaching of coral reef ecosystems. The five phases identified based on more than 3,000 scuba surveys in Hawaii, but are believed to have a global application. So these range from high coral cover with high fish biomass through three intermediate phases to low coral over and low, co uh, and low fish biomass. Sorry. So even with small shifts in environmental conditions causing tipping points in reef ecosystems, the researchers believe that fishery managers can use their approach to identify and avoid the sort of abrupt changes that can threaten coral reefs. So reefs have that have been affected by overfishing, bleaching and storm impacts can be recoverable, but only as a result of collective global action and prevention. So if every single government body could take up these five steps, then more reefs can be saved and also managed. So anyway, what do you think about these five new steps? Do you think that this is a great way to help manage and prevent any more damage happening to coral reefs around the world, or is it too little too late? Let's have a chat about it in the comments. If you're watching this on Twitter, then why not give us a like and a retweet, and to our awesome YouTube family, you know what to do. Thanks for watching, and save darling. We are an online dive store serving the UK and the world for all your diving equipment needs. So why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen.